Simon, congratulations, what a performance that was. Yeah, thank you, I'm in shock still. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the uh, highest average of the uh, tournament so far as well, 105. How do you manage it? <laughs> I really don't know. I just, I think concentration was a big thing. I went up there, you know, just, I know I can play the game. And I know I've had the worst preparation ever for this tournament. And I've just gone up there and I've just concentrated every single dart. And, and I don't know, <laughs> they just seemed to go in for me. But, um, Commentator John Gwynn mentioned that you know some some horses run better when they're fresh. You know, is that a case? Is it sometimes maybe you can practice too much in that sense? And yeah, of course. I mean, I think having seven weeks off darts has made me very keen again, and just I'm just so excited to be playing darts again now. Uh, realistically, what were you thinking? I never thought I'd get past the first round. Once I broke my ankle, you know, even the doctor said you won't be playing. And I've gone against doctor's orders to be walking on my foot. They said I can start walking on Monday. I did it the Monday before. But, you know. but, uh, I mean, how do you prepare for something like that? I mean, even even getting to the walk on you know, it's an effort in itself for you. It is. The, the good thing is it's my left leg, which doesn't affect my throw. Yeah. I can still throw with my arm, my arm's fine. And I wasn't going to let my foot beat me. And, uh, and Steve beats him in the next round as well. That'll be a crack at that one. Yeah, for sure. I mean, Steve's fantastic player, world champion. It's going to be a hard match. And, uh, and finally, loving the new hairstyle as well. What, <laughs> yeah, what was the inspiration for that? Uh, it's a long story. <laughs> All because I broke my leg. I was on my back for two weeks and yeah. I got this massive dreadlock. I just turned into one big dreadlock, like this giant sausage. <laughs> and I thought, well, what am I going to do with this? And I let it go, let it go, Didn't bro couldn't brush it. And then I seen a lady and she, she de-knotted it, took her four hours to get all the, the one big dreadlock out and then she braided it for me. So I was there for nine hours. Oh, <laughs> quite therapeutic in there. Oh, painful, <laughs> do you? Simon, congratulations. Enjoy your Christmas. Thank and you. we'll see you in the second round. Cheers, thanks very much. Cheers.